Welcome to another update from the Force 13 on the developing tropical low up in the Arafura Sea near Darwin Northern Territory. Tropical low has developed in the monsoon trough over the northern Arafura Sea about 400 kilometres north of the Coburg Peninsula. The low is expected to move to the southwest from Thursday, passing to the northwest of the Tiwi Islands early on Friday before moving out into the Timor Sea. The environment in the Arafura Sea is not favourable for development, but the low may develop into a tropical cyclone by Saturday as it moves into more favourable conditions over the Timor Sea by which time it will be moving away from the Northern Territory. And for today, the Bureau has percentages for development on low, but increasing moderate Friday to high on Saturday. Bureau Meteorology Northern Territory at 4.18am local time today has issued a severe weather warning for damaging winds, heavy rainfall for people in the Tiwi, parts of the Daly and Arnhem districts. 1,003 metabar load is developing in the Arafura Sea, about 400 kilometres north-northeast of the Tiwi Islands. The low will gradually intensify as it moves southwest into the Timor Sea, passing to the northwest of the Tiwi Islands before reaching the Timor Sea during Friday. Damaging winds averaging 60 to 70 kilometres an hour with peak gusts of around 100 kilometres an hour would develop over the Tiwi Islands, Coburg Peninsula. From early Thursday afternoon, peak winds will initially be associated with thunderstorms. Heavy rain may lead to flash flooding, will develop over the Tiwi Islands, the peninsula on Thursday afternoon, and 24-hour totals in excess of 100 millimetres are possible. The heavy rain will begin to ease over the peninsula on Friday, but continue over the Tiwi Islands. On the screen is a look at the NOAA floaters, and the tropical A is clearly Uh, intensify when you look at the cloud tops. Damaging winds averaging 50 to 60 kilometres an hour, peak gusts of around 100 kilometres an hour, expected to develop across the northern daily and northwest Arnhem districts during Thursday afternoon before extending south toward I on Friday. Peak wind gusts will initially be associated with uh, thunderstorms. These conditions are expected to continue into Friday and locations uh, under the severe weather warning uh, Darwin, Palmerston, Jabiru, Managuta, Woodai, Bachelor, Adelaide River and Pine Creek. Sea service temperature very healthy around the 29 to 30 Celsius mark. Now we have a look at the latest instability. This is from 7 a.m. through to around lunch time Friday. Bureau Meteorology Northern Territory has a strong wind warning in place for the North Tiwi case and they've cancelled a 140 hour of USC. However, for Friday, the Beagle Boner Park and North Tiwi Coast. That'll be for a strong wind warning. Now we have a look at storm uh, probability percentages. Bureau of Meteorology in uh, Tasmania has a strong wind warning for the far northwest coast and then a have a gale wind warning for the central west coast on Friday. Strong wind warning for the Storm Bay far northwest 
case, Bank Strait, Franklin Sound, east of the Flinders Island, Upper East, Lower East, South East, South West Coast. Now we have a look at the GFS win probability and other than the tropical low up there in the Northern Territory WA border region we can have a look at the strong wind factor and gale force factor to the south of Australia. And you can clearly see how the tropical lay is developing. The information is at the bottom left of the screen. Each of these images are free hourly. Now we have a look at the precipitation. It's the same model. And in this uh, particular update, we have a close look at the Northern Territory area. Information bottom of the screen right hand corner. We will continue to bring the latest information across the main channel and the AU channel. And as the Bureau said, once it uh, gets into the uh, Tibor Sea, conditions will increase uh, considerably. Here's the latest uh, Bureau of Meteorology's total forecast of rain. The picture has slightly changed, but again, it's the blue through to the pink. Another look at the tracks and model consensus clearly indicates landfall crossing possible. The yellow is the Canadian, the NAFCHEM is the one I think in purple. Yep, and the GFS is the red. And this is the current uh, position, the service plot. Invest 97S, 8 decimal 4 degrees south, 132 decimal 3 degrees east. Winds 25 knots. Central pressure has increased to 1006 millibars. Joy Typhoon warning center that their position hasn't changed since our earlier update. And they have 97S medium for further development and Finally, in this update, a look at various models. GP, GFS. HWRF parent. HWRF Intensity Pressure right hand side of the screen and the icon model We will have more later You can follow Force 13's outlets the website force13.com our YouTube page, youtube.com forward slash force13. On Facebook, under the same name, force13. And our Twitter handle, it's at force13 if you wish to get in touch. You can also add force13 on Skype, 
and my personal account on Discord, Fool13, at extension 9094.